I'm notifying you, you're being recorded right now. Go ahead and speak. We're going to be on public property. You can't restrict our use of public property. I'm not. I'm just saying. The street and the right of way on this side are private. There's a right of way. If you, you go to the town hall, you can see where the right of way is. I, I, I don't have that. any problem with that. That's, that's, you know, whatever you want is your right in this country. Freedom of speech. I'm all for that. The other thing is, we're inviting people to the church to bring them to God. We're and away God from, and and away from being homosexual. Tell them that what they are is an abomination. And that's the not, a, not at all. You should have come last... The speaker that we had last night was, was very, very good. Why, they, why do you guys oppose everything? Anti-discrimination laws. Anti you know, post marriage. Post gay marriage, I assume. Well, I think you should step this way, Jen. Now, what we cannot be is on the road. Okay. That's very clear. Well, I, I wish you the best of luck. We're, we're, we're opening our doors to people to bring them to God. And we respect it. We have no intention of disrupting. And that's all we're about. Yeah, I'm, I'm a Christian as well, sir, and my God okay. doesn't tell me I'm wrong because I'm gay. Exodus International... I, I don't think we're telling anybody they're wrong because they're gay. Exodus International teaches people conversion therapy. Conversion okay. therapy kills. Kills what? Kills people. Kids. We, have, we, we know kids who committed suicide after being put through this. But kids commit suicide if they haven't been through this. People commit suicide when they're... When you aggravate it, it gets much worse. Yeah. yeah. Well, that, that would be... Gay teens yeah. commit suicide because they don't feel they're good enough. Right. And that's what you're helping to teach. You put out a negative message about the way people are, the way we were born. That's why we're here. That's interesting. To be honest with you, I, I don't know a lot about this. I volunteer here, mm. you know, but I'm a member of this church. And, uh, I'm a Episcopalian. And I, and I, uh, My church welcomes gay people. It's who we are. The bishop of this state is gay. Well, it's my, I'm sharing my faith experience with you. I'm a Episcopalian. My church affirms gay people as who they are without having to make them straight. We're a Bible-based church. So, so is the Episcopal church. No, no, you don't no, own the Bible. Just a minute. So we have a more I think you probably have a Bronze Age interpretation of the Bible. We have a modern interpretation. In a bit. Have a good day, guys. Did you want to leave your name for the record, sir? Right.